Why the 10cc reunion album, meanwhile, from 1992, was not that successful or fun. I'm John Bowden from Rock History Music. Our special guest is the last remaining member in 10CC, Graham Goldman. Godley and Cream left 10CC in the 70s, but they came back in 1992 for a, a reunion album. And Kevin and Law came back for Meanwhile. And by the way, I'll ask you about Jeff Picard because he was on that album. Was that a good experience when they came back for Meanwhile? No, it was a bad experience. And I'll tell you why. And it was nothing, I mean, it was an honor to work with Jeff Picard and Freddie Washington. They were amazing. Um, First of all, the concept of Eric and I working with other musicians rather than our own guys. Undoubtedly, they were amongst the top musicians in the world, but it, they weren't our guys. So I never played bass on that album at all, I don't think. Um, I don't think Eric played much keyboards. Uh, he did play some guitar, but it was kind of somebody else's album. We didn't get on very well with Gary Katz. Eric certainly didn't get on with Gary Katz. There was a bad vibe throughout the whole thing, and it's an album I can't really listen to. I don't like it. I think some of the songs are good, but I'm, if, I would, if I think about it, um, The Night That The Stars Didn't Show I like, but it's got a kind of a weight of a, a depressive sort of cloud over it. So... The answer to your question, I think I've answered. <laughs> well, do you, when you go to write, Graham, with people, there must be times where people get a little intimidated by you. I mean, you have written a lot of songs, not only 10CC, but obviously all the ones before that for, for the other folks, but... I'm a very kind, nice person and generous to a fault and, <laughs> and modest too. Yeah. So... Um, I think, it, it, like anything, like the musicians I work with, like the, all the people I work with are really good people, right? Uh, they're good at what they do, but they're good souls as well, and I want to be with those sort of people. Because mm -hmm. they're like me, you know, I don't need any shit in my life, to put it bluntly. So it, it, it's the same with, with writing. I understand it would be, it could be intimidating, um, but it might be a bit intimidating at the beginning, but by the time we've sort of settled down and got to know each other, it's fine. Yeah. It's fine. Uh, and I wouldn't want anybody to feel like that anyway. The brand new Graham Goldman album, Modesty Forbids, is coming out in just a few days on our sister channel, Rock History Book. We'll have clips from every single track, and Graham will talk about every single track on the album and the inspiration behind it. Make sure you subscribe to that channel. It's Rock History Book. There'll be a link in the description of this video. Remember, buy a t-shirt, help us get the videos out to you a lot faster, because now we're basically hiring interns to chop up the interviews so we can get them to you faster. So just simply buy a t-shirt. They're good quality, and it helps support our channel. I'm John Bowden from Rocky Stream Music. <laughs>